talked about the issues of early recruiting and how you kind of bemoan the fact that it has to happen. Is there anything that can be done about that? Well, I mean, you can't legislate ethics. So, you know, no matter what the, what the advantage someone gains from, from possession, uh, it, it really seems to, to, to kind of ring true. I, I don't know how to do it. I'm, I'm concerned because uh, the recruiting of 13 and 14 year old girls and offering them scholarships, although they might be terrific players, really calls a lot of things into question. You know, does the coach have a contract that's extending five years out? Uh, can the school, I mean, can the players sign, sign the coach in the school to, to make a commitment right now? It's now the going the opposite direction where the player goes, hey, okay, I want to go to school X. You guys have to guarantee me that I'm going to have a scholarship because you can't guarantee me this coach is going to be here in five years or four years. So it's just the price of doing business. Uh, I'm not a fan of it, uh, but I also recognize there's going to be some circumstances where uh, coaches, maybe they're involved in club, have great uh, relationships and access to players and know that they want those players in their program and the kids know that that's the school for them. You know, many years ago, Nebraska, you know, uh, the twins that have had such great careers at Nebraska, you know, they're Nebraska kids and they knew they wanted to go to Nebraska. So, it, you know, it's a no brainer that uh, it happens. You know, maybe there's some people that felt it was too early, but, you know, as a, as a coach on the outside, it made perfect sense to me.